Hi, Brian. What's up? How are you? Good. What the hell is this thing? I think you'd be down here. Hmm? It's a good fishing pole. Where's your pole? Uh, I'm uh, stretching my... Uh, you don't need a pole anymore now that you got your open carry license. You can just shoot him out of the water. He won't uh, care. Uh, yeah, he would. <laughs> It'd bounce off him. Uh, yeah, he would be good. Like that one? Yeah, there's some monsters in here. 60, I've seen videos in pulling on 65 pound flag. Yeah, real men jump in there and catch them barehanded. <laughs> what sucks is it's actually illegal. Yeah, I saw it. Really it's not really illegal unless you get caught, right? Yeah. <laughs> I was just stretching the scooter legs. It looks like a POS, but it runs. It got me from there to Battleground, so. Really? Yeah. Sweet modify it so I can have my rod holder on the side and I just bring my backpack. You always have to watch your pole because I've had them almost yanked down the hand out here. Really? <laughs> then you get rocks and all kinds of debris. That's no, putting tremendous stress on that support. Most of the conservation officers are cool arms. Mm -hmm. Ain't that cool if they give people tickets for trying to feed their family? Is that cool? Yeah, you need so all that you need permission to feed your family off the earth, you know. It sucks. Yeah, well, private pond you don't, but rivers it. Yeah, but who owns the rivers? God. <laughs> earth. There you go. We the people do. He's got a four wheeler today. Yeah, I know. He's gonna hit the trails. Well, over there is a really good spot, but you have to watch out for the rocks. What kind of fish you pull out of here? Carp, sturgeon, flatheads, blues, yellow, or uh, bullheads, uh, stripe, bass, uh, large, small. Is there any Asian carp in here? Yeah, <laughs> big, big. What's the biggest fish in here? Well, I'm not exactly for sure what the record is. <laughs> Go see if he finds anybody else. 
I got some questions for this guy too. I'm gonna end up getting poison ivy. Hey, 312, I've got a question for you. What's that? What's, uh, how's that work with like your fishing licenses? What about it? Are people required to yes. show proof? Yep. Is that, is that, isn't there something like when you get your fishing license, you agree to that or something? That's what I thought. No, I'm going. Going to be good? No. You have your fishing license on you? Oh no, I'm 17. Okay. Yeah, I, I okay. Yeah. Do you have ID by chance? Yeah. Or I could make sure that you don't need one. Sure. Cool. Alrighty. Awesome. Good, Good luck. Nice yep, you too. Yeah, I thought there was something on there when I signed. I can't yeah. remember. It's been a minute. It's a good hiding spot over here, huh? Yeah. Well, I saw these two coming off the railroad bridge a second ago. People still jump off these bridges anymore? Not that I've seen. The river's awfully shallow to be yeah. taking that chance. Lake Freeman, though. Yeah. It's a mud hole out here today. There you have it, DNR on patrol. Do we have like deer poachers and stuff problems here? Oh yeah. Not quite so many this time of year, but they're still. Yeah. Does in season make a difference or is that more of an out of season thing? Well, poaching is a pretty broad term. Yeah. So, you know, I mean, poaching. pulling off, shooting one on the side of the road. Right. Yeah, you know. that's that's the traditional poaching, what you would call. It. Yeah. But even taking it out of season is technically, yeah, same a person thing. takes it without a license. Yeah. I mean, you could make the argument that they're sure they're poaching. same thing. Take care. You too. Zero one three one. Supposed to have ATVs and stuff registered in Indiana. He's got his trailer plate all in order. Freeze, mother truckers, I'm out. No, I'm not. 
This is Wabash Heritage Trail. That's where I'm at. Called Davis Ferry Bridge.